Hello there my friends, welcome to part 52 of my Horizon Zero Dawn full blind playthrough on the PlayStation 5. We are playing on ultra difficulty and what we're going to do today guys, I was actually going to move on from Free Heap. This is the quest we did for Petra um, where we took down like a bandit camp and we used a, an amazing weapon and I hope I get to use it again. It's called an Osram Cannon I think bloody awesome i loved it <laughs> absolutely great so anyway so that's the last episode i was going to move on and um i'll show you what i plan to do for the next few episodes i actually need to explore this strip here well i guess we could do that can we okay sorry i'm just thinking out loud ignore me guys i was just thinking because there's some undiscovered campfires machines here as well there's a corrupted zone here as well level 32 um what i'm gonna do guys i'm gonna do most corrupted zones a bit later in because i actually want to start frozen wilds pretty soon <laughs> right um i was told there's some unique dialogue if i go there a little bit early so i'd like to do that but not just yet not just yet i was gonna go here one second where is it oh god damn it i keep getting lost here no it's down here it's down here i'm in the wrong place right there's a whole load of um you know question mark i mean exclamation mark side quests here so uh, i'd like to check this all out however where we are now there is actually a side quest so let's check this out real quick and um probably next episode we'll go up uh west all right i don't know what this is about but this is kaaloof is that his name are you looking for something can't see hide nor hair of my friends they went after a herd of behemoths, and now they're overdue. Only seasoned hunters go after machines like that. Can't they handle themselves? It's not them I'm worried about. We need special cables from those behemoths to keep our cannons firing. If they miss the herd, Petra will hand me my hide. I never should have agreed to that trade. Shit. <laughs> Guys, we've never fought a behemoth before. But anyway, it's fine. I don't mind. Let's, let's see what they're like. What trade did you agree to? Petra assigned me and Balaja the task of getting cables from that herd. But Tor Greece and Balaja are meant for each other. Like hammer and steel. They just don't realize it. So I agreed to trade duties with him to, you know, hurry things along. Didn't Balaja wonder why? It was her idea. Now I'm worried it worked too well. If they're so busy snogging that they missed a herd, it'll be my skin on the line. <laughs> this is interesting. Where did you last see them? Right here, before they left. Off they went, arguing the whole way. What were they arguing about? How best to follow the herd. Jor Grease is good with a bow, but he could get lost in his own home. What have I done? <laughs> All right, Petra. Why not explain what happened to Petra? If you want to tell Petra, be my guest. Maybe she'll blow her top at you and tire herself out before she gets to me. All right, I'll look for your friends. I'm a little nervous, but we'll give it a try, guys. I would run off in search of them, but since Jor Grease took my place, I have his spot on guard duty. I can look for your friends. Where have they gone? They were headed to the arch northwest of here to watch for the herd. I hope they've found their way there. If we miss that herd, we won't be able to keep our cannons firing. I'll throw myself into this fire if I've risked our freedom. Let's keep that as a last resort. I'll do what I can. All right, so we've now got a errand called Hammer and Steel. So read that real quick. Two hunters from the Free Heap have gone astray tracking a behemoth convoy. convoy. Aloy is asked to find the hunters and their prey. Talk to Petra. We get a generous reward box and 5,000 XP. Awesome. <laughs> right, let's uh, see Petra. Petra's awesome, man. I like her. Um, okay, where is she? There she is. <laughs> okay. What's up, Petra? Always so pale. A few minutes at the forge, the heat'll put some color in your cheeks. <sighs> I don't need a forge for that. Rushing into the wilds should do it. Mmm, what's lit your fire this time? I can handle it. No doubt you can, but if it involves free heap, I need to hear about it. <sighs> you sent two hunters after a herd. They've gone missing. 
Well, they couldn't have. Caliph could find a needle in a slag heap. Unless he didn't go. Careless, two-fisted smelter. What'd he do? Traded places with Jagri's. By fire and spit! <laughs> She's a little bit pissed. What are you gonna do about this trade? Waste of Caliph's time and mine. Jogri's and Baladia didn't need his push. They're bound together. Just like in the forge. You let the weight of the hammer do the work, not the arm. Never figured Caliph for a tender sort. <laughs> You're not angry? Oh, I'll make him sweat it. But one thing I've learned, some things will happen no matter what you do. That's actually true. <laughs> right, behemoth cables? Why did you need behemoth cables from that herd? Those cables make the best fuses for our cannons. Even so, they wear out fast and we always need more. Our guns keep us strong and free. Without them, we're easy scrap for bandits and machines. You could trade for them. Some supplies we need to get on our own, or we're dependent on others. That's a burden we won't bear. But you asked me for help. <laughs> Some burdens are welcome. Why the urgency with this herd? Once that herd hits the cauldron, it'll be out of our reach, and another won't come for a long while. We need those cables, and we've got to take them now. Okay, I'll keep an eye out. If you find those two, send them back in one piece. If you bring me behemoth cables while you're at it, I'd be beholden to you. Careful. It could become a habit. <laughs> All right, cool. Oh, did I not select it? God damn it. Such a bad habit. Oh, we need to help Olin. My God, he must have been waiting at that place for like five weeks. All right, guys. So we need to go where on the map? Oh, that's crazy, guys. Because remember, I was actually saying I wanted to go along here. Uh, yeah, let's just follow the map. It's fine. It's okay. All right. Anyway. Okay, let's go down. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> no, don't want to do that. Okay. Let's do this properly. <laughs> and what I'm going to do closer up there, I'm going to read the um, machine catalogue again because, guys, I can't remember anything about behemoths except they look very scary. So I need to actually read up about their weak points, etc. All right, here we go. Right, there's a thunder jaw there, I think. Okay. Gosh, it's so beautiful. <laughs> what a great game, guys. Whoa, who are you? Hold on, who are you? Oh, shit. Um, wait, 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 wait. Wait, hold on. Sorry, guys, did you hear that? That was, um, the Thunderjaw music. Okay, all right, let's get out of here, guys. <laughs> I don't want to hang around. Uh, not that I don't mind fighting Thunder Jaws, I do, but just want to kind of stick to the quest. <laughs> uh, one thing with me, guys, I get very distracted very easily. Right, what does that say? Pitchcliff, okay, cool. Right, where? Oh, no, please, no, Clint Hawks. Where are we actually going, though? Oh, we're still quite far, my god. <laughs> One sec. Alright, leave me alone, Glint Hawks. Oh, okay, guys. One second. Let's just go here. Oh, crap. Oh, god damn it. Oh, no. I shouldn't have come here. Oh, my god. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Go, go, go. <laughs> go, go, go. Please. Is this actually the right way, though? Guys, we're dead. Whoa, okay. Okay. Alright, guys. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, this was not part of the plan at all. Oh god, no! <laughs> Arsehole. Okay, let's get out of here, guys. He's trying to throw snowballs at me, the son of a bitch. I mean, I could fight them, but I don't really want to. I just don't really care. <laughs> okay. Are we close? 
Are they up here? Oh, anyway, whatever. All right, let's get another mount. <laughs> Gosh, that was such a mess. All right, guys. Okay. So let's go this way. Oh, I have to look for them around here. So we're actually in the area. There they are. Bloody hell. <laughs> you had us wandering for hours. That's what I'm looking for. That's because I couldn't concentrate with you hammering on. You kept asking me questions. When did I start smithing? Had I ever seen the elevator at Meridian? If Caleb had been here, we'd have found the herd. I, I would have taken it down and we'd be halfway back to Freeheap. You want to go back? Fine. I don't even know why I'm here. I don't either. I got us this far. You had us wandering for hours. <laughs> That's because I couldn't concentrate with you. All oh, right, they're just repeating that. I just wanted to hear that dialogue, guys. It doesn't seem like they get along. I know Osser and love, love to argue. Okay, anyway. Are you Ja Grease and Balaja? Caliph sent me to look for you. He did? Now Petra must know we lost the herd. No, I lost it. I don't care who lost it. Just why don't I track it down for you? I couldn't let you do that. It was my responsibility, not yours or his. We saw three behemoths and some shell walkers in the herd. Three. It won't be easy alone. Uh, I don't know, guys. <laughs> Should I do this alone? Let's do it alone. Let me try it. I've got to, I've got to try it. I've got to practice. I've not fought them before. I can sneak up on the herd better without conversation. Arguing, you mean. <laughs> I'll go with you alone. Your grease can ask his incessant questions to the wind. Why did you even agree to the trade if you can't stand a minute of my presence? If you weren't... Enough! <laughs> ja Grease, Baladia asked you to switch with Caliph so she could spend time with you. What? And if I heard right, Ja Grease led you off course so he could spend more time talking with you. Uh, really? Now you talk it out <laughs> while I get those behemoth cables. Where did you last see the herd? Oh, uh, up on that ridge. And take some arrows with you. <sighs> Thanks. That's awesome. <laughs> this is a lot of fun, actually. Okay, up on that ridge meaning what? Okay, hold on, guys. Uh, what? Oh, here, okay. So we need to go there, but it's not giving me... No, it is, it is. I'm just blind. Gosh, I'm nervous, man. I'm not gonna lie to you. These things, I've run past them before. I've scanned them. I, I don't remember what episode. And I've run past them a couple of times. They look so scary. That's a trampler. Yeah, that's not it. Follow the convoy's tracks. What? what? Okay, it's here. Why is it telling me to go here? whole highlight track guys i didn't even see that my goodness okay all right <laughs> oh my guys i'm lost i'm so sorry i don't know what the hell is going on here so the last time i come right here All right, tramplers, leave me alone, man. Okay, this way, right? Guys, this game is so gorgeous. I know this is the six billionth time I'm saying that, but I don't care. It is gorgeous. It's just amazing, honestly. Whoa, crap. Oh, that's a tree. <laughs> There's a tree in the distance. I thought that might have been the behemoth. Wait. Wait, 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 guys. The Shit, they're there. All right, guys, I need to read up on them because I do not remember anything about them. Okay, machine catalog and behemoth. They look kind of like a rhino or a triceratops without horns. Okay, we can override it, by the way, so I'll probably try and override one of them. 
charges an Overon's target with its great bulk or uses lifting engines to launch rocks at range. Oh, crap. Okay. So weakness, um, nothing to its body, that is. Uh, crate holders, detach the cargo container. Freeze canister, freeze. I've got a freeze arrow now. A force loader. What the hell is that? Okay, destroying this component disables the lifting attacks. I have no idea what lifting attack is, but it must be when it... Oh, I get it. I get it. When it shoots a ranged attack at you, so... Right, a power cell, which is located where? How the hell am I supposed to get that? It's really tucked in. Guys, let's just see what happens. I, I, I don't know. I don't know what to expect here. I'd like to override one, at least. And if it is too difficult to override... Jesus, there's three of them. Maybe I should have... Ugh. Maybe I should have let those two come with me. Right, where are we on the map? Could I not go... Shit, you see, if I opened these camps, I could have teleported and cut them off. <laughs> I know it's cheating slightly, but still. Damn it, guys. All right, guys, wait, wait, hold on. I've got an idea. I've got an idea. Check this out. We're going to use my war bow. I've got it installed. God damn it. Okay. Right, he should attack his buddies. However... We're going to do that as well. So we're going to cause a bit of trouble. Oh my god. Holy crap, guys. The AOE. Where's his stomach? <laughs> what? Oh shit. Guys, I'm so scared to fight them, man. Okay, let me, let me do one more. What the hell, man? Jesus. Come on, come on. Guys, look at the state of that shell walker. <laughs> Guys, that's insane. That is insane. All right, is it just him? No, 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 wait. Guys, wow. Oh, I feel sorry for him now. Okay, look, he's weakened. I feel a bit bad doing this. I want to actually fire one properly. However, I know where some are, so. Oh shit, there's a shell walker. God damn it, I thought you were all dead. Whoa, 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 what's he doing? Oh, he's dead. Okay, I'm gonna fight some more, guys. Let's just kill this stupid shell walker real quick. All right, good. I need his force field. Oh, go away. Dude! Oh, my God. Wait. How do I do this? All right, good, good. Okay, that's taken off, it's fine. All right, let's just frost him up. And we'll be done with this. All right, done, mission accomplished. But what I'm gonna do is when this is finished, okay, let me show you real quick. Okay, this is where I first met all of these behemoths. I think it was up here, right? Um, that's it, make his end. I couldn't remember the quest name. So I'm gonna fight one of them maybe just to just to see what they're like. But they do a ton of damage by the looks of it, guys. <laughs> it's actually quite scary. But anyway. Alright, let me do some looting. I'll be back with you uh, very soon. Hey guys. Um, okay. Wow, they give a ton of uh purples, which is amazing. Now, I need some behemoth cables, so let's just do that. 
All right, let's pick these up. <laughs> Guys, it's all purple. Okay, the reason I'm bringing this up, Not too much I have a fit. Oh crap! You're you're serious. I just cleared out my um. Anyway, anyway. All right, guys. Before I do that, I was gonna say I think it's better to farm them than maybe Thunder Jaws. You know, just to farm them for purple uh, mods. Anyway, just give me a few moments. I'm just gonna sort this out. All right, guys. Okay, we're done. I think. Deliver the Behemoth cables to uh, Petra. Okay. Um. <sighs> Guys, I tell you what, let me just go along with this. I just want to open up these camps in case I need to come back here. So we'll go for a quick ride. Um, is there anything else here? Have I left anything? What's that? Oh, I missed something. Chill water. <laughs> Alright, cool guys. Alrighty, okay, so we want to go here. There's a merchant there as well. Awesome. Okay So we go for a quick ride Okay, excellent, so we've got that so we want to go here And turn right I think Oh, guys, <laughs> breathtaking views. It's amazing. Ah, shit. One second. Okay, so I want to get to this camp here. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> Go away. Oh, shit, there's ravages there as well. Okay. Right, that's all over. Oh, crap. <laughs> Sorry. Let me just get out of here, guys. One second. Why are there so many freaking lance swords, man? Oh, my God. Will you leave me alone, please? Oh, no. There's freaking uh, glint hawks, guys. All right. I'm getting out of here. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm out of here. Uh, wh what's that? Okay, uh, guys. I'll look at that later. Let's just get this um, side quest done. <laughs> okay. Anyway, at least there's a side quest there. See you later. Hey guys, we're back. Safe and sound. <laughs> back in free heap. Uh, also, just very quickly as well, we're going to go for this um, metal flower. Um, so we'll do that afterwards. And finally, there's still a few like this road here. Okay, we may as well do that. I'm trying to open this up just to free up the map a bit. But anyway, we'll tackle that when the time comes. Right, let's go up here. And speak to Petra. You've got those behemoth cables, don't you? I knew you'd come through. And Jagri's and Baladia should be along. Eventually. Mmm, we've been expecting you ever since they came back. Whatever you did, it worked. Now they're off snogging in the shed. Finally. What? She put me on guard duty for a month, so I'm glad it was worth it. Thank you. <laughs> no problem. I see you survived their bickering. Uh, barely. I could say they struggle in love because they're young, but the old rarely fare better. Thank you, Aloy, for enduring them. Oh, this was awesome, guys. <laughs> so, uh, Aloy plays, um, <laughs> hookup, really, isn't it? That's, that's awesome. Are they actually here, though? I mean, talk to them, maybe. No, I don't think so. All right, let's go and grab that uh, metal flower. All right, so we want to go up here. However, okay, by the looks of it, I need to go through this, rev like, I don't know what to call this, a chasm or whatever. So we'll go through here. Anyway, let's grab a strider. Uh, let's go down this way. Right, I hope that freaking storm bear doesn't see me. <laughs> I'm sure he will, but it's okay. We'll kick the shit out of him. Alright, no, still down. Go away. Go away. Do not turn red. Do not turn red, you son of a bitch. 
God damn it, guys. Okay. Oh, go away. Leave me alone. I'm not here for you. Oh, wow. This looks nice. Whoa, guys. What is this place? All right, good. Stormbird lost interest. But look at this. Okay, is this a new actual area or... Just having a look, guys. If It may not be anything, but still, very nice. Dawn Sentinel. Okay. All right, cool. Excellent. <laughs> All right, we'll do a quick save. All right, awesome. Okay, let's go. Oh, shit. We're going to run into the Stormbird again. However... Right, we need to cut across this way, I'm guessing. And there's machines. There's freaking scrappers in. Oh. No peace. <laughs> All right. But I've got a surprise for them. Yeah, fire your buddy. <laughs> he KO'd him. <laughs> <laughs> he one shot him. Okay, excellent. <laughs> All right. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. All right, excellent. There we go. Oh, my God. I just cleaned out my uh, resources um, before I did this episode, guys. Oh, my God. Unbelievable. Okay, just give me a few moments. Let me sort this out. All right, guys. Here we go. I don't actually know where I could be. However, let's just get closer there. Oh no, Glint Hawks, really? Great, my favorite. All right, I'm just seeing. All right, this must. It has to. Uh, yeah, let me start again. This has to be it. <laughs> That's what I meant to say. All right, awesome. There we go, guys. Right, Mel Flower, let's read this poetry. And here we go. Very short. When dawn henners her hands with the blood of the horizon, let the new bride of the golden veil uncover her shining face. Awesome. All right, so there we go. Anything else here, though? I was going to go into Nora lands. I'm definitely going to do it, guys, but not in this episode. Um... We need to visit Rost's grave. In fact, guys, I tell you what, let's finish up. Let's go and see Rost. And we may as well get this. <laughs> so we'll get this metal flower as well. I'll see you there. Guys, we've come a long way. We really have. My God, it was weeks ago when I, <laughs> you know, first did the playthrough. This is insane, man. Anyway, let's uh, visit Rost. I feel so sad. I mean... I wish he could see what what we know about, you know, uncovering what zero, uh, Horizon Zero Dawn is. Or Zero Dawn, sorry. Anyway. Hi, Rost. I'll, uh, I'll just take this off. Don't want him listening in. Oh, silence. Hi, Rost. A lot has happened. Elizabeth Sobek, she couldn't have been my mother. She was an old one. She lived ages ago. Still, there is a connection. The hatch. It thought I was her. It's... it's really strange. Somehow, Elizabeth stopped war machines from destroying the world. She couldn't save the civilization of the Old Ones. That was destroyed, obviously. But life... It survived. She saved life from... being devoured. I... I need to know how Elizabeth stopped the machines. If I can find the weapon she built, and use it, the Eclipse won't stand a chance. I went to the Grave Horde. 
It lived up to its name. Millions of people fought and died to give Elizabeth the time she needed to finish Zero Dawn. The weapon she built, it, it wasn't there, but I found out where she built it. A secret base west of here, right under Sunfall, the capital of the Shadow Karja. So, getting inside, it's... Well, it's, it's gonna take some doing. I crashed the Eclipse Focus Network. It was a close call. I nearly died a bunch of times. I saw it rust. Face to face. Hades. An ancient Pharaoh Titan, or maybe something worse. When I opened the module casing, it was like I had a vision. A world being destroyed. Exterminated. I think that's what it wants, Rost. Extinction. Anyway, I, I heard it. Blinded it. Made it so it can't see through the Eclipse's eyes, can't talk to them over distances. So it's time. Time for me to go to Sunfall and learn about Zero Dawn. Wish me luck. Killers from the Proving. They aren't gonna hurt anyone anymore. I tracked them to Devil's Grief. There was a battle. And we won. Varl, he... made an impression. Has some other issues, but... <laughs> I like him. Well... Sunfall beckons. Next time we talk, maybe I'll... Know all about Zero Dawn. Goodbye. Wow, guys, I'm not gonna lie to you. I had a slight, a very, very tiny little tear in the corner of my eye. <laughs> that was, um, got dark. That was really beautiful. It really was. Wait, where's the map telling me to go? Wait, can I access it from here? Uh, the metal flower, I mean, sorry. No, it's down. 181 steps. How, how do we do this? <laughs> I'm scared, guys. I don't want to fall off. All right, I tell you what. Let's go here, perhaps. So we'll get this and, and then we'll will be done it has to be up here guys meaning go up here go over this ridge it's not letting me go any further ah crap okay plan b what i was thinking we could do is travel up this way okay is there any hidden paths sometimes there's like little pathways to get up there all right in any case wait wait in any case let me go here there might be a climbable here so let's try that. All right, guys, we're here. Okie dokie. Right. Am I correct in assuming we might be able to climb upwards? There has to be some... Sorry, handhold. Sorry. Um, Give me a sec. Oh, that's not it. What in the hell? Well, I can see something there, guys. There's like a rope there. All right, let's start again. Let's try this again. Wait, 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 hold on. Is that a pathway to go up there? Oh my God, guys. Look, I'll tell you what, let me find this damn thing. I'm gonna skip ahead and I will show you how I found it. Hey guys. It's me. Okay, I teleported back to Ross's place. Okay, there's a path here. Let's just... Okay, I'll tell you what. Let me go there. I can kind of make out a little pathway here, but I'm not sure. But we'll see. I could be totally way off. But we need to get up there somehow. It has to be up here. 
All right, hold on, guys, hold on. Damn, guys, there's still no, um... Wait, 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 hold up, what's this? Okay, fine, but will this actually take me to the metal flower? All right, guys, let's try it out. Let's see. I could be totally off here. Okay. <laughs> I hope this works. Right, check it out. There's some uh, climbables here. Come on, house. Come up on my focus. There it is, guys. Check it out. Whoa. Okay, how do I do this? And guys, just going back to, you know, what Aloy was saying to Rost. I'm still... Whoa, is this right? Oh, it is right. It's here. <laughs> Sorry. I'm very much convinced Hades is the Hearts Timor rogue AI, and it's evolved, and it's just come back to destroy the world. I could be wrong, but we'll see. <laughs> anyway. Yay! All right, we got it at last. Bloody old Elza. Oh, that's really short. My God. Evening wind, water laps, the heron's legs. Okay, cool. All right, guys. Look, we'll leave it there for now. Um, next episode, I'd like to fight a behemoth. <laughs> like, so I'll show you how, how much I'm going to suck there. But I am still undecided what I want to actually do. Um, I'm trying to not complete absolutely everything, but I'm trying to do some... Well, look, we got vantage points. Oh, whoa, there's a town here. Oh, shit, I didn't even know. There's actually a town here, guys. However, I did find some of these, so maybe we want to do a couple of these um, side quests. And then we're going to do a tall neck, and then we're going to do the main quest. So we'll leave it there, guys, and I hope you enjoyed yourselves. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next video. Take care.